friends, it's me. Today we are here in my old setup. I still have it. And today we're gonna be checking out some pranks. Y'all see this? My non-reflective glasses. What you doing? Why you reflecting so much? What is this? Useless. Now I can't see. Also, I always wanted to try this with my dogs, but I don't have a glass coffee table. So you basically act like you're gonna give them food, but give it to them on top of the glass table. Drop those chips for Fido. And he could be like, Hold up! where they go? But they fall on the table. Apparently dogs can't see glass. So he's just like, what kind of voodoo magic is this? Why have you forsaken me, human? You wanna win five dollars? Sure. Okay. Follow the cup. Where is it? Pick it up. Good job. <laughs> Classic. The trick is, is like, here's five dollars. Let me put it here and then move it really slow so that they can like follow it Now you guys have seen this So if your friends try to pull this on you pick one of the other cups because they got all the game Fill up a juice jug with water and mix in a packet of powdered cheese to make it look like orange juice to Serve up everybody for breakfast like glass of ice. Oh, I made some fresh squeezed orange juice Bruh imagine drinking iced cheese sauce. You know your girl loves cheese cheese just just not iced okay that's nasty I don't think y'all are ready for this one cuz I'm not we're gonna swap out deodorant and cream cheese no baby not the cream cheese that's my life source right there I live off of cream cheese <laughs> oh this is sick so basically take the whole deodorant stick out and then swap the cream cheese into the deodorant container oh okay we're doing it like that oh I thought we were gonna eat deodorant instead but basically Basically put it back in and like add some little details like put some hair into the cream cheese and then put your friends deodorant back This is straight up cruel, but if you're trying to give somebody some cheesy pits, I got you That poor kid, all he wanted was a vanilla cone. And this dude really playing games with a five-year-old. You mean this ice cream? You, 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 you want this? You want it? I don't think you really want it. If you want it, just take it. <laughs> it's funny because kids don't get agitated like adults do. Be like, come on, man. Like, I just wanted my ice cream. I just wanted my vanilla cone. I should have went to McDonald's. See, what I tell you about animals not being able to see anything see-through. It just doesn't exist to them. They put plastic wrap over the kitty door. So when the cat comes that was like <laughs> <laughs> I thought cats were supposed to be smarter than that. Now I gotta do this because I know 100% my dogs will fall for this. Smash like if you would try this. Oh, no, 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 no. So, this one. A very detailed guide on how to make a cardboard poo. Take a toilet paper roll. Wet it. Gotta get it real moist till it's falling apart. And then rip it apart. Squeeze it together. Oh, no. You have an actual poo. And then put it on your toilet at work. Put it on your colleague's desk. Perhaps the printer where the paper comes out of. Or on your boss's chair. Watch them try to figure out who was the animal in the workplace. Pooping on everything. <laughs> now you know how to make fake poop out of cardboard and water. Very useful knowledge to have, okay? Two bottles of dish soap goes a long way. Oh! No, you didn't. No, you didn't. I would not advise you to try this unless you own the fountain and you're trying to have a bubble bath in the middle of the city. I'm not gonna lie, that is amazing. I didn't know it was like foamed up so much. Who knew you could use dish soap instead of bubble bath? Like y'all out here buying lush bath bombs for like ten dollars, while dish soap's like two dollars. You get more bubble for your buck. Oh my God, this took me a second. This is terrifying. Oh. Oh no! Imagine someone pull up in your drive-thru like this. I was like, what is going on in this picture? This dude is wearing his car seat. Looking like Baymac from Big Hero 6. <laughs> car seat edition. Okay, but I wanna know how would you drive in this situation? I know you can get the hands through, but you can't really get the legs through. So like, you can't 
actually drive. Otherwise, this would be like a pretty cool drive through prank to pull. We got a new toaster in the break room. I turned it around and then placed a simple sign on it. Funniest day at the office. <laughs> it's voice activated. You know, if you work with a lot of older people, and it's like they don't understand technology. They're gonna see printed instructions on an electronic. They're gonna do what it says, okay? It's voice activated. Toast my bread. Medium toast, please. Hello? Toaster activate. Are you toasting? I think it's broken. Seriously though, people will hella fall for this. See, this would be a funny office prank if this was just water. What is that? Blue Gatorade? That's like one wrong move. And it's over. Sticky blue Gatorade everywhere. I want to know where they got this much Gatorade in the first place. Those cups ain't even filled like just a little bit. They're, most of them are like half a good halfway, one third full. They put a lot of effort into this prank. I'm just going to take a lot of effort to clean this without making a bigger mess. By way, am I going to feel it? Or you can get a spider crawling on the screen? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah relax, relax, relax. Don't drop my, don't drop my phone. Oh, my God. I can take my finger. Look, I can even go inside like this. Look, look, look. Touch it like this. Oh, what? Bring it back out. <laughs> oh, look, it's going to go away. If I wave, no, no, no. If I wave like this, I, I can bring it back when it disappears. No That's really cool, right? Yeah, it's really cool. Now it disappears. Do me a favor, right? Yeah, yeah. Take your hand and wave and pull it back to me. Do what? Call it back. Over and pull it, pull it back. <laughs> <laughs> do that? There's a magic trick. You ready for a toasty shower? Okay, this one is wholesome. Just toast up the shower. Good morning, time to get this bread. Dang right it is. <laughs> this car's license plate is the fattest troll. Is it an 8? Is it a B? Is it a B? Is it an 8? So when they get pulled over, the cop just might, if you're lucky, not put in the right license plate or it'll just take them a while. I mean, y'all must get pulled over a lot to be like, okay, you know what? I'm a mess with these cops a little bit. Make my license plate a nightmare to input. I mean, I'll be there like, son, what does your license plate read? What? I said, you're free to go, sir. You at work. You can't find your stapler. Colleagues, where is my stapler? I baked you a pie. Oh boy, what flavor? Stapler. It's jello, but like that sounded much better in my head. Why does that jello look like pickle juice jello? That color look a little off. Mommy is cute, it's just chilling in there. This is just straight up D-bag, okay? If you're trying to be annoying, you absolutely hate someone in your workplace and there is only one bathroom stall and you know your worst nightmare just had Taco Bell and you know he can't hold it. They put shoes and pants, locked the door, made it seem like somebody's in the bathroom, taking the longest dump of their life. But it ain't even a person. They ain't even taking a dump. They just chilling there. Coffee John's got some uh, empty coffee cups here. We're going to be playing a prank on some people in the office. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, 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 Coffee, John. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I would not go near anybody who is holding four hot coffee cups like that. No thanks. I ain't trying to get third degree burns today. I don't care if the cups are empty, full, or lukewarm. Nah. Relocate this fake snake in your local grocer's lettuce aisle? Oh, okay, this is this is going a little too far. Like, imagine all the middle-aged moms that are gonna walk by just trying to pick up the iceberg lettuce, and then they see this. It looks like a snake! I mean, if you're trying to make somebody scream, you're trying to ruin someone's day, you're trying to give them a heart attack, put a fake snake in the lettuce. <laughs> if you dip cotton balls in water, they'll stick to anything on a cold night. Ooh, I did not know that. You know, this is very valuable information to have. So if you ever gotta stick them anywhere, that actually looks really cool. That is one soft, fluffy car now. We'd caress softly. Okay, no, that's going too far. A fake toilet paper roll. Y'all really made a fake toilet paper roll. It's not real. It only has tissues around it. And when you pull out like two tissues, it's like April Fool's. Joke's on you, I got my hand. I'm just kidding, but not. Nah, there's like one, two, three, four, five, at least five sheets of toilet paper on the fake one. So, I mean, we can work with this. But I don't know, some people like to use a lot of toilet paper paper so y'all kind of screwed comment below how much toilet paper do you use do you like wrap your whole hand do you only use like three sheets do you not use any we want to know have fun cleaning this up love you daddy okay first of all it's water so it won't be that bad if you really wanted to like make somebody's life hell you will put coke gatorade or some sticky drink in there Ooh, coffee coffee is a good one i still 
copy on my countertop months ago. I've been cleaning it for the past few weeks and it hasn't like completely gone away. Like I haven't got every single nook and cranny. So basically how you do this is take a piece of paper, that one that she left a note with, and just slide it under the cup and like quickly, you wanna have the cup and the paper like, and then just flip real quick. Someone's getting grounded. Oh no, somebody wrote voice activated. Just say paper towel, please. It's funny because this one looks so legit. Everybody knows that these are like touch censored. But this sticker looks so real that people are actually gonna walk up to this and be like, paper towel, please. And then I'll actually give it to them and they'll keep doing it. Cause people will fall for anything. Somebody stuck a paper to the little peephole in a door. I don't want you to look inside. Oh. <laughs> Damn, it actually looks legit. You know, that was like one of my greatest fears when I was a kid. Looking through the peephole on my door in my house and then seeing somebody like looking through at the same time. Like I was always terrified of that. Now I don't have a peephole. You can't hurt me anymore. They won't be clean, but they'll be shiny. Oh, they replaced hand sanitizer with lubricating jelly. That's nasty. The poor fool. Who thinks they're getting hand sanitizer? They're gonna be rubbing their hands, rubbing their hands, rubbing their hands. Be like, oh. why won't it soak up into my skin? That is sickening, but we're here for it. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face and comment below. Which one of these would you actually try? And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And make sure you subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.